Hey friends, Nick from Penguin Magic here to give you my top five coin slides. These are my five favorite slides that I've used throughout my career in Magic. They've served me well, and now I'm gonna share them with all of you. And before we get to number five, please subscribe to us here on Penguin Magic. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Let's check out number five. Number five, the thumb palm. When you get into coin magic, there are lots of ways to conceal a coin. I've gotten the most mileage out of the thumb palm, which is a concealment where the coin is clipped between the thumb and the base of this finger here. Obviously from this side it's exposed, but from this side it is clipped right in between here. Best way to get into it is from this position, from the, the tips of your fingers, you just curl your hand in, let that coin hit the base of your thumb and pointer finger, and then let your thumb clamp down onto it so that it's in thumb palm. Now it's a very easy thing to do a false transfer from here. It's an essential move that I just included. So all you have to do is curl your fingers in, clip that coin, and then pretend to put it in your other hand as your right hand comes away. You have all this freedom with your fingers, which makes it look really clean and open. All you have to do is give it a little jingle here and the coin melts away. You can even give the hand a wipe with the other hand, making it look like everything is completely empty, except we both know that the coin is hidden here. So the thumb palm is my favorite way to conceal a coin. Number four, complete coin vanish. This is an awesome way to completely vanish a coin using nothing more than thumb palm, and your shirt. Let me show you how it works. You're gonna take the coin and false transfer it into your left hand. We already learned that. We already know the coin is still right here in my right hand. And right after you do the transfer, your right hand is going to grab your shirt to pull up your sleeve to eliminate any, you know, that you so you can't use your sleeve. But what watch what happens. As your hand drifts up your arm, it's gonna go right above your pocket and your thumb is just gonna deposit that coin in your top pocket. And your hand's gonna come back down, snap, wave your hand, whatever you do, and that coin completely disappears. And it is an amazing way to completely vanish a coin by using nothing more than thumb palm in your shirt. It's a good one, number four. Number three, the appearing coin. This might be the most magical way to make a coin appear, and it uses a very uh, exotic coin position, the back thumb palm, which is the same thing as thumb palm, except that happens on the back side of the hand, right? So uh, it's put between my thumb and the pointer finger, but if you were to look at the palm of the hand, the coin cannot be seen, right? What's gonna happen to make this coin appear is several things at the same time. You're going to have your hand in a position and it's going to just drop a few inches. So from here to here, and you're gonna let that gravity pull the coin out from behind your hand. The way that's gonna happen is as your hand drops, you're also going to open your thumb and close your thumb to let that coin slip out into the palm of your hand. It's very difficult to do slow. I'll show you exactly what it looks like from that thumb clip position. All you have to do is drop your hand and let that coin fall over and it looks like it just appears like magic. And that is number three, the coin appearance. Before we get to number two and one, I just wanna let you know there is a link to a free video below that will teach you even more tricks that you can do with the slights that you've already learned from this video. So that is absolutely free and found in the description below. Now, let's get to number two. Number two, the coin switch. Switching a coin is an essential move that you're gonna need to learn if you're going to do some coin magic. And this is one of my favorites. Here's how it works. The coin that you're gonna switch in is in your right hand, clipped between your pointer and middle finger, just like that. So from the front, can't be seen. But from here, it's just clipped right there. This is the coin you're gonna switch in. The coin you're gonna take out is in your left hand at the tips of your pointer and middle finger. And here's what happens. You're you're just going to be doing this. It's going to appear as if you're just turning this coin over. But when you have this coin clipped, you're gonna come underneath with your thumb, push this coin up into your hand, 
as you let this coin rotate around your fingers and this one comes back into your hand into a nice finger palm as you've essentially switched in the other coin. And that is Bob Elliott's flip switch. Number one, the coin steal. Man, this is such a cool way to steal a coin from a closed fist. Let me show you how it works. You're gonna wrap your fingers around, your, uh, around the coin in your hand. However, when you turn your hand over, what you're gonna do is kind of jostle the coin in your hand so that it ends up on the tips of your fingers. So if we look this way, it's gonna end up here. So as I turn my hand over, I kind of get it on the tips of my fingers and I push that coin back in the, like the heel of my hand, okay? Now, if you come around the front here, that coin can't be seen, right? But we both know that it's just hanging out the back. What's gonna happen is my right hand is going to just tap the back of my hand here. And when it taps here, the mi middle finger and my ring finger are just going to extend, clip that coin, and bring it right back into my hand and steal it right out. How cool is that? Now all you have to do is relax your right hand, do a magical gesture, and the coin has completely vanished. It's number one, coin steal. So those are my top five coin slice. Let me know below what your favorite slights are as well. And if you're looking for even more tricks to do, I've put together a completely free video that you can have down in the description below. It'll take you over to Penguin Magic where you can learn more tricks and more slights that you can do out of Thumb Palm and some of my other favorite moves. With, uh, make sure you like and subscribe here on Penguin Magic so that you can stay up to date with all of the videos. My name is Nick. I'll see you next time.